arms, if you please. I thank you, and in return... Ah, you came. Thanks to your efforts, I've received a fine piece of Satsuma pottery. It should fetch a high price overseas. At any rate, I was hoping to exhibit an ukiyo-e print and its woodblock at the upcoming international exhibition. As it happens, I found a collector who owns a masterpiece of the genre. After some negotiating, he agreed to lend it to me, if I did a certain job for him. Can I count on your help? The Collector is a very wealthy man, so I'm sure we'll be duly rewarded. Oh, most certainly. A single ukiyo-e print brings together a host of refined techniques masterfully honed by artists, carvers, and printers. Which is why I want to pair it with its woodblock to show our printmaking process. I'm sure it will be a big hit. <laughs> That's the spirit. Besides, the Collector is presently right here in Edo. Let me take you to him. Shall we be on our way? Ukiyo-e can be cheaply manufactured. You just need the original woodblock. That's why it's popular among the masses. we're borrowing is by a famous artist named Hokusai Katsushika. The owner is a great admirer of his works. We've arrived. I wondered who it might be, but I wasn't expecting you. So, you're not entirely an enemy of the state, I see. Before you ask, I haven't seen your samurai friend. I don't know anything more, so let's not waste our time. So, you're not entirely immune to a bit of avarice. A relief, I must say. Oh, you know each other. Excellent. Then let us get straight to business. We will take on that job you mentioned, if you'll kindly lend me the woodblock. Ah, yes. It is my hope that it makes waves at the International Exposition. Unfortunately, there's talk that someone is trying to steal it. I will not stand idly by and wait for these ruthless scoundrels to take my property. And that's where you come in. To root out some thieves? I agree. We mustn't leave such men to their own devices. In fact, I'd be more than happy to oblige. Oh, a connoisseur, are you? 
Then I shall rest assured you're the right one for the assignment. In any case, the first thing we need to do is lure the rats into the open, then nab them. Naturally, we mustn't let any harm come to the Consul General. Therefore, as soon as the thieves show up, we should whisk Mr. Harris to safety. Well then, let us get ourselves ready. That's a hog sight for you! Even the wood block is magnificent! I can already imagine exhibition goers marveling at the exhibit! <laughs> With this, my acclaim shall flourish. You've done exceptionally. Please, leave the rest to me. This way. Oh, they're here! The thieves! Quickly, to the console! What the? Like they have accomplices. We need to get to the consul at once. I couldn't stop them. They've taken the wood block. I'll tend to the consul. You go after the thieves. You're coming with me to the Commissioner's office. But first, tell me one thing. Why were you so anxious to get your hands on this woodblock? 
Hokusai's bold compositions are said to capture the true essence of the ukiyo-e art form. Surely, there are correctors who'd pay anything to own one. I can see that you are not some simple outlaw. Tell me, have you ever worked as a merchant before? I have. It was my former occupation, but I've since fallen on hard times, as you no doubt can see. Now, I have neither status nor money. Therefore, it was my intention to steal the print and gain a second wreath on life. A crime is a crime, no matter its motivation. One works to get money to buy what they need. Surely, that is the way of things in both our nations. Now that Japan has opened its doors to the world, we can expect there to be many changes in the way we do business here. International trade will serve as an opportunity to greatly enrich our nation. But to make the best of it, we'll need the support of merchants like yourself. As a vassal of the Shogunate, I vow to remake Japanese commerce for a new age. And I hope you'll contribute too. By honest means, of course. I'll consider it. But you better not be paying me mere rip service. That's the end of that business, I suppose. Here, a bit more than I promised. May it help you find your... Samurai friend. Hey! Hello. Thanks for your help, as ever. I'm sorry to ask, but can I trouble you with one more little request? Tatsugoro's in something of a bind, you see. There's a shogunate man causing trouble for him. Surely you remember. He's the leader of the firefighters. You borrowed some men from him on our behalf. Well, given my position, I can't exactly be seen to intervene. What we need is solid proof of his wrongdoing. Why don't you start by getting the full story from Tatsugoro? Thanks. 
And I promise you will be duly compensated for this. You'll find him at the lumber yard in Fukugawa. Oh, look who it is! Hmm? Ah, his lordship Katsu sent you, did he? I take it you're up to speed. The new man from the Shogunate is a real piece of work. He's conspired with the supplier to hike up the price of lumber. Now, all the carpenters in town are worried they won't be able to work. As a firefighter, I can't let this go unchecked. When the house burns down, my job isn't over till it's been rebuilt. If only I can smack some sense into those boys. But we can't be seen doing that. No, this job requires subtlety. And besides, all my strapping young men are in Katsu's care now. Of course, if you would lend us your skills, we could get this done in no time. Ha ha ha! Sorry, friend. I'd love to be able to sort it myself, truly. Katsu's likely thinking the same thing. You know, way back when, he gets into fights at the drop of a hat. His father had a nasty temper too. Suppose the apple doesn't fall far from the tree. Ah, but his lordship has his title to worry about now. He can't just do as he pleases anymore. Anyway, our government man is supposedly conducting some furtive talks close by. Can you go right away? Thanks. I know you can handle yourself, but please be careful.
You're back, and Lord Katsu wasn't able to resist showing up. But it seems you didn't leave any work for him. Nonsense. I knew our friend here would take care of everything. I can't be drawing my sword over every petty squabble now, can I? Thanks for taking care of this. So, 
Did you find the evidence we were looking for? I knew I could rely on you. He won't be able to talk his way out with this evidence. I'll take it from here. What are you saying? He doesn't deserve to die for what he did. Besides, I have a few questions I want to ask him. I'm glad you didn't finish the job, so to speak. I have a little extra on me for a task well done. Now the carpenters should be able to get back to work. Just you wait. They'll have those burnt down houses rebuilt in no time. Ah, that's good to hear. I can't bear seeing my beloved hometown in this state. Right. It's time I got going. Don't worry, though. I have plenty more work for you. Buddy, come over here, will you? Got any sake? I thought I had some, but it seems I drunk it all up. What are you trying to pull? Oh, this'll do just fine. Thanks. I was wondering when you'd next join. I'm glad to see you. Really? That would be great. Oh, it looks like you have quite the collection. Good work. What would you like me to work on? I have a hunch you will be back again. Am I right? How are you? You again? What is it? And what would that be? Ah, so you remember what I said at the British legation? Hm. I only wish the answer was so simple. When I'm sure you people are nothing but savages, you reveal a refinement in the most unexpected of places. 
Whatever it is, it is certain the English do not have it. It seems clear that you are no ordinary people. That is all I can state with certainty. Amusing. Very well, then. Till we meet again. Been well, I trust. Ah, music to my ears. I was hoping you'd say that. Taken any photographs lately? I'd love to see them. Be sure to drop by again. Academy. I'm rather fond of photographic devices. In fact, I come here quite often. At any rate, I have been looking for a capable fighter like you. Moreover, someone without ties to the Shogunate. You see, it seems that some of my retainers have become involved in shady dealings with a merchant. It was I who disclosed the matter. The same thing happened in Yokohama, remember? I figured that there was something rotten in the state of Edo. At any rate, our friend here should be able to put your men in line. <laughs> Which is why I'd like to procure some irrefutable evidence. With this camera. Got it? What a fine idea! Hey, you still have the camera I gave you? I've picked up a few things on my own, and I'm particularly fond of this camera Igoshichi built for me. I feel like it's entirely done away with the need for silver and wet plates. Indeed. Nothing else compares. You said it! Word is, they're experimenting with dry plates abroad. But even that would offer limited colors for exposure. Meanwhile, my camera is easy to use and produces great results. You see, I based the designs and ideas previously worked out by the first Igashichi, and... Oh! There I go again. Well, will you help me procure the evidence I need? I'm afraid that calling on a servant would only complicate matters sorely. Good. We'll head out when the alleged deal is set to take place.
Shogunate is big and it's unwieldy. Even I cannot deal with corrupt officials as I please, and I'm the Shogun. I hear the scoundrels have gone from merely taking bribes to selling arms to the highest bidder, whoever that may be. That's why we need to secure proof. But to be clear, this is not an assassination. This is where the transaction will take place. Let's slip in undetected. ignore this, or we must catch the killer. We've hooked ourselves a big fish. How come you're here? Master Katsu had us follow you at a distance. If only we had not lost sight of you. Worry not. I'm much obliged. That Katsu. Always one step ahead. I suppose I owe you my thanks as well. Yes, 
Thanks to Takahashi's big mouth, calling out Your Excellency rather gave the game away. Uh, but what's done is done. Get some ninja to look into that old man, will you? I'd prefer to have seen those criminals tried. But I suppose the result would have been the same. Sorry to have troubled you. Oh, there you are. You, we're busy looking for someone. Can I trust you not to get in our way? Word is a renowned martial arts master is training on this mountain. So we've come to hone our skills. I'd really like to get to Takasugi's level one day. My word. Can you not go two minutes without mentioning that man's name? You don't want to talk? You're constantly going, Kusaka this, Kusaka that. Moving on. You hammered us good and proper at Ine's place. We're painfully aware of our need to grow if we're to achieve anything. Sorry to disappoint you, but we were working alone. We were merely hoping to bolster his plans somewhat. We wanted to have Dr. Ine show us how to make the poison. It would have made a fine arrow in our quiver against the Shogunate. Hey, I just realized. The martial arts master we're after competed in the tournament at the military academy. Didn't you compete too? If you're already acquainted, would you ask him to let us train with him? Ah, thank you. Much obliged. Over there. Is that him? He looks kind of young. You there? You're not Jigoro Kano, are you? Yes? Can I help you? Ah, I remember you from the military academy. Famed. I don't know if I'll go quite so far, though I suppose I've received a fair bit of attention since then. And we're acquaintances too. I 
wonder, would you be so kind as to teach us to fight? You want me to teach you? Hmm. I've had some nasty rumors about Choshu of late, and as a member of the military academy, my hands might be tied. Very well. After all, you did go out of your way to find me. I suppose we could run through a few training exercises. Wonderful. We're very much looking forward to it. There's a place up ahead I often used to train. Let's go over there now. This is where I practice my hill sprints, where I run full steam from the base all the way to the top. By using often neglected muscle groups, I strengthen not only my legs, but my entire body. Naturally, it also helps to build stamina. I don't know. This sounds rather basic. Yeah, let's make it interesting. What if we race to see who can reach the top first? All right, time to finally show you who's boss. Master Kano, give us the signal. Very well. But remember, this is training. Ready? Go! I've got this! I can perfectly hold my own here. You! Stand back, Ito! If anyone should stand back, it's you, Yamagata. You Joshu boys are in fine shape. You'll excel in the fighting arts, I'm sure. <laughs> that was a piece of cake, huh? All right then, let's move on to the next exercise. This is where I like to practice sparring. I want you to face off one-on-one -on -one with another as if you were engaging in a real combat. What technique you choose is entirely up to you. I see. Got any tips before we begin? The success of your training depends on you and your partner. That is, you must approach your fight with a willingness to help each other succeed. Got it. Master Kano, it'd be my honor to train with someone of your caliber. I expect you'd be able to wipe the floor with me, would you not? Yes. Well, I'm afraid you're not quite at my level. But perhaps the three of you could try and take me on together. <clears throat> what? The nerve of this guy! We'll make you eat those words! Come on, Ito! Let's get him! The three of us can take him down! Please come at me however you'd like! Saw that! You're fooling yourself if you think you're the best of the three of us! Don't come crying afterwards! Perhaps one against three was a bit ambitious. I can't believe how much one man made, made a struggle. I underestimated him. I suppose that's what you get from a famous martial artist. If we keep training like that, 
Do you think we could get that strong? I suppose. Shall we get back to it then? I should thank you too. I appreciate you vouching for us. You're fairly generous yourself, the way I see it. We're going to get stronger. Just you wait. Strong enough to pay back what we owe you one day. <laughs>